a strategic review of the United Nations mission in South Sudan's peacekeeping role in the conflict-afflicted country will begin later this month, ahead of consideration of its mandate by the UN Security Council. The current mandate, which came into force in December 2016, authorises UNMIS to use all necessary means to protect civilians. It also authorises the mission to monitor and investigate human rights, create conditions conducive to the delivery of humanitarian assistance and to support the implementation of the peace agreement. That mandate expires next month. In the next few weeks, a review team from the UN headquarters will travel to South Sudan to consider the security and humanitarian situation, consult with a wide range of people in the capital, as well as in more remote parts of the country. It will also speak with other South Sudanese groups based in Addis Ababa, including the opposition. What we would like to do is that um, through the strategic review that we're, we're having out uh, here, um, be able to canvas and, and, and understand some of the uh, the issues and the, and, the, and the opinions of people here so that we can feed into that, uh, into that decision that will be made ultimately by the Security Council. It is the 15-member Security Council based in New York that will decide whether to extend the mandate, not UNMIS. The review team's findings, as well as other consultation processes, will inform their decision-making. South Sudan has been plagued by ongoing conflict since the outbreak of civil war in 2013, two years after the country won independence and joined the UN to become the world's newest nation. Four million people have fled to neighbouring countries to escape the violence or are internally displaced, with 213,000 people living in sites protected by UN peacekeepers. We're not looking at uh, the mandate not being renewed at the moment. There's no plan B, there's only a plan A uh, that the mandate will be renewed. Um, so inshallah, I hope it is and, uh, and uh, we're able to, uh, able to continue on as we are. If it, if it doesn't, then we'll, we'll, uh, we'll frantically start planning. The Security Council is expected to consider the issue of the UNMIS mandate at a meeting next month.